In this video, we'll look at how to find the oxidation number for the iron here in this iron three chromate. So to do that, the first thing to recognize is there's no negative or positive sign after this whole compound. So it's a neutral compound. All the oxidation numbers, they add up to zero. So to figure this out, you need to realize that the CrO4, this is called the chromate ion, and the whole thing has a two minus ionic charge. That's important because if we have an ion, like our chromate ion here, all the oxidation numbers, they add up to the charge on the ion. So all these oxidation numbers here, they add up to minus two. So three times our two minus, we get a minus six. That's the total for the oxidation numbers here. For this to be neutral, everything to add up to zero, the iron has to be a plus six. So two times something gives us plus six, two times plus three, that'll give us our plus six. So the oxidation number on each iron in Fe2CrO43, that's gonna be plus three. Just a quick word about how we write ions and oxidation numbers. Oxidation numbers has the sign before the number. This is an ion, so the sign comes after the number. That's why I'm doing it that way. If you need help finding the oxidation number for the chromium in the chromate ion, there's a link in the description on how to do that. This is Dr. B with the oxidation number for Fe in Fe2Cr043, iron 3 chromate. Thanks for watching.